Hey dudes, I'm Atheline, back at it again with another Ask Draft video. I hope you guys are all doing uh, fine. Uh, thank you guys for the uh, the big interest in Ask Draft, as I've seen from last video, which uh, is a reason why I'm back again uh, two times in a row with another Ask Draft video. Um, today I will be reviewing, actually it was an idea from someone else, I will be reviewing all the new modules that they added to Ask Draft as of right now. However, this could change in two days as the season's about to change, and I'm waiting for it to. But um, yeah, today we're gonna do all the new modules, most of them not being like actual modules modules, but most of them being building modules. And they bring something really new and fun to the game. But first off, there's the railgun being an amazing weapon. We're gonna check that out later. Then you have all the building blocks, and that's pretty much it, other than the AA gun, which the AA gun is pretty cool. However, they have like all the other normal modules to buy, and which is still a lot. I'm pretty sure that they're still adding them. As uh, we'll see from the new season, we'll see from the new season. But first off, let's check out the railgun. The railgun I did a review on. I want to say about a month ago or a month or two ago. The railgun is pretty decent, and I went back on today to try it again. And it, I've noticed something that I didn't notice last time. The railgun is like. It has like four charges, I mean five charges as you guys see, and uh, it takes a while to recharge, however this shoots faster, way faster than the ballista. Probably just because of balancing reasons they added the, uh, they added that just because it takes a while for it to actually shoot, because it's priming. But another thing I noticed is that the laser actually cuts through the shield, which is absolutely amazing because now that pretty much took out the counter to ballistas, which was just shields. So pretty much this is a ballista that cuts through shields, effectively giving it no weakness other than time. So in theory, it is by far broken. But uh, yeah, it's pretty solid. And then we're going to check out the new building modules. I personally like the new building modules. They all seem really nifty. They're all like these tube designs and they connect. So there's pretty much two versions of them. There's this tube, which is pretty much just flat on the side. And then the second version, which def has like the uh, little square thing. Honestly, I like this one more just because it looks cooler in my opinion. But they definitely all have like different type of style. I do not think they have stronger uh, things though. The half slab is freaking amazing. The half slab will definitely be amazing on laser builds. And the new obliques look really cool as well. These are definitely for builds when you have like different types of slopes and triangles. Then you have the uh, half slabs with the, uh, I guess the slope as well, for just other interesting builds. The half slab is also amazing. The half slab is by far the most broken thing in this. You have the half triangle and then you have that, or whatever it's called. That I could see being used on some cool wings. And then the half triangle, amazing. I see that being used as pretty much, I'm pretty sure they don't have the same hitbox, but aiming, pretty much you would have to take out that block. Which means that the shield, like, you can now put a block in front of a laser. That's what I'm pretty much trying to say. And that is absolutely amazing, just because laser is, like, notorious for being bad. And the AA gun is still amazing. The What I've noticed in Trials, especially this one, is that the AA gun, I, from what I see, does almost the same damage. Except has a bit more, um, I guess, spread of fire as the Midnight Party. Effectively making it the same gun, however this definitely has more ammo, and other than like having to sacrifice some accuracy, it still does a ton of damage, like it absolutely chews up builds. So honestly, this is definitely a contender. Midnight Party I still do feel does a bit more damage, but having this max ammo capacity that the AA gun has is absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all of the new modules. Uh, thank you guys for watching this. And uh, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more Ashcraft stuff. But that's about it. See you, nerds.